Remember everybody, for deliveries these days, if it requires a signature, they're going to be showing up in a uniform, FedEx, UPS, Postal Service. If it's a random person showing up in an unmarked vehicle, like an Amazon driver, they too should also be in uniform with a professional vest. And if not, and they're saying that you need to provide a signature, you definitely do not be need to answering your door. So I want you to go back and I want you to watch a couple of things from that clip right there. One, notice how the guy has the package and his other hand is pied off so that you can't see what he's doing. Remember, hands are the first thing we always want to identify when it comes to confirming whether or not somebody's a threat. Second is that he looks, you can notice his eyes, he looks as the door opens, he looks into the home to see if anybody else is present with the person answering the door. And when he realized there isn't, he goes and attempts to make that entry and pull out the firearm on the homeowner. This homeowner had really quick thinking by realizing what's this guy doing, taking so many steps into my house, pushes him back, which is where we then see the gun get displayed. Unfortunately, he doesn't push him down the stairs and hurt him because quite honestly, that's justified in this instant. So my question to you is, can you use justified lethal self-defense in your state in this situation when a guy pulls out a gun on you and attempts to make entry into your home. All right, let me know your thoughts. Take care.